Two years ago, I made a video showing how much weight each of the Mavic drones that I owned could lift. I fabricated like this apparatus with, with, uh, with a box and a string. So I got something a little better this time. It's been two years, so I figured it was time for an update because we have new drones now. So today I'm gonna see how much weight the Mini 3 Pro, the Air 2S, and the Mavic 3 can lift. And then also, if I can figure this out, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to, but I kinda wanna see how much the Avada can lift. Um, I know you're never gonna lift anything with your Avada, but I just kinda wanna see you know, how much weight it can lift, but I have to figure out a way to attach it to the bottom. So stick around for that. If I can, if I can figure that out, I might add that at the end. But what I'm gonna do is I have a zip tie around the drone and I have this steel cable, very lightweight steel cable that I got from uh, Zing Drone Delivery out of California. And then I have a, one of Aldrin's flight cases here. And basically what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna lift the drone up. I'm gonna start throwing in some weight. And what I have for weight today is I have a bowl of keys. And why do I have a bowl of keys? I'm gonna explain that a little bit later here in the video. But uh, if you're into practical jokes, there's something that you can do. There's a lot of things you can do with a box of keys from eBay, but, uh, but that's what I'm gonna do and start throwing keys in here. And I don't know what it's gonna weigh until it's done. So I'm gonna just put weight in there until the drone can't hold it anymore. I'll bring the drone down, I'll cut it off, and then I'll weigh it. And I'll put everything up on the screen. And also I'm gonna put all the details up on the screen too, because last time I did this video, a lot of you had different questions. What was the barometric pressure? What was the temperature? What was the wind? Uh, did you have it in sport mode? And, all kinds of questions. I'm gonna put as many answers as I can up on the screen. And yes, I am gonna do it in sport mode because that's gonna give us the most thrust. So let's get the Mini 3 Pro up in the air. Here a little bit, all right. Okay, so. There we go. Now let's start throwing some keys in here. Let's do about a half a dozen. Okay, no problem. A couple more. That's good. One thing I do want to check here. I'm going to check the battery. Someone said, hey, show me the battery. Nope, okay, no, nope. still got, nope. <laughs> okay, let's take a couple out. All right, I think that's it, let's do one more. Okay, that's gonna be it right there. All right, the batteries, there's nothing wrong with the battery, battery's the same, all right? So let's bring it down. All right, let's bring this over here. I got my little kitchen scale. And I'll just start recording with my Insta360. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna wrap the cable around the flight case here, full of keys. I'm gonna zero out my scale. All right, and let's throw it on there. It looks like we have 10 ounces. All right, 10 ounces for the Mini 3 Pro. And then what I'll do is I'll put the, uh, the power ratio, I guess is what I call it. How much does the Mini 3 Pro weigh? And then how much can it lift? And what is the um, power ratio? I'll put that up on the screen. So 10 ounces for the Mini 3 Pro. All right, let's go ahead and uh, rig up the Air 2S now. And let's see what that one can do. All right, next I have the Air 2S rigged up. Now, if I did my math right, the uh, power ratio on the Mini 3 Pro is like 1.14. That's really surprising. Like 10 ounces, I think is 283 grams. I'm not sure. And like I, I'm speaking in Imperial and uh, I'll put up the uh, metric numbers on the screen as well. But, uh, but let's get the Air 2S up. Let's see how this one does. Should be, oh, ooh, that was close. <laughs> Okay, here we go. I still love this drone so much. It is one of the best drones of all time. It, seriously. Okay, let's start throwing some keys in here. 
Better zip this up. I'm starting to get a lot of keys in there. Oh. Okay. Wow, this is a lot heavier than I thought it was going to be. Okay, there it's coming down. Okay. Wow, that is really good. Okay, I am very impressed with that. This is a lot of weight. Let's check this out. Wow, that's, that's a lot of weight. Okay, let's wrap this up. So basically, just so you guys can see what I'm doing, I'm just wrapping the cable around it, and that way I can weigh everything. And then also, I'll make sure that I have the weight of the zip tie on here, uh, up on the screen. Okay. We have one pound, seven and a half ounces. So one pound, seven and a half ounces. That is a ton of weight. So let's see how the Mavic 3 does. All right, Mavic 3 is ready to go. Um, I figured a 1.12 power ratio on the Air 2S. So just a little bit under, almost the same as the Mini 3 Pro. So pound for pound, or I should say, gram for gram, the Mini 3 Pro is about as strong, you know, as the Air 2S. But anyway, uh, this is gonna be quite a bit heavier. So I already threw some keys into the flight case. Let's get this up and see what the Mavic 3 can do. Okay. All right, there we go. All right, so we have, oh, let's get this on here all the way. Two pounds, exactly two pounds, 32 ounces. So that's pretty strong. All right, so, um, all right, and I'll put all the stats, like I said, up on the screen so you guys can see. Let's, um, I'm gonna see if I can figure out the Avada here. So, uh, so give me just a second. All right, I think I got it figured out. I just uh, took one screw out of the bottom sensors and then I just put the cable in there. I don't know, is this dumb? Yeah, but let's see if it works. Also, I took off um, the bumpers, these ribbed bumpers from original Dobo. I wouldn't fly the Avada without these anymore. Um, so I'll put a link for these down in the video description. There's like, they're like 25 bucks, I think. Totally worth it. A nice design. Good job, uh, Ken. But uh, let's see if the Avada can lift anything at all. I don't know. Like I said, this is probably stupid, but, but we'll give it a try, all right? Oh. Uh, I guess it, it timed out because I didn't have it hooked up. Um, so I suppose <laughs> I'm in a geo zone. So I suppose it just said, hey, you're going to have to land. But I think it did pretty good. Let's just, I know this isn't going to be accurate. Um, but hey, I, it did pretty good. But let me get this unhooked and then we'll see exactly what's in here. I think it was pretty close to its maximum, but, uh, but let's check it out. We can get this to stay on there. Looks like we got 13.75 ounces. So just under 14 ounces. And yes, I know you guys, that's not gonna be accurate, uh, but you know it can lift at least that much. You know it can lift at least 14 ounces. But um, like I said, it's probably not something you're gonna do on a regular basis you know, carry things around with your Vada, but it's worth a try, right? So like I said, what's the point of this test? Really, there is no point other than, you know, seeing how much 
you can lift. How this all got started is during the pandemic, uh, I was just screwing around with my neighbor and I delivered some toilet paper to him when we had our toilet paper shortage. But, uh, but anyway, that's how it kind of got started. So uh, I didn't figure out the ratio for the Mavic 3, but I'll put everything up on the screen here for you guys. All the information is right there. If you have any questions, put them down in the comments. Oh, and then the keys. So why do I have a box of keys? Okay, so here's a prank and this is fun, but also you're gonna do this to somebody that you really hate or somebody that really appreciates practical jokes. But what you do, go on eBay, you can order a box of keys, just random keys. Okay, I got a small box and I wanna say it was 25 bucks. And then you get yourself some, uh, some key tags and you hook a key tag to each key and then you put your victim's phone number on there and then you put home. Like put their home phone number on the, or their cell number and then put home. And then what you do is you walk around town and you just throw these keys wherever you go. <laughs> out on the street, out on the park, um, in stores, everywhere you go, just start throwing keys everywhere. And you know, let's say you got a hundred keys, your buddy or your enemy is gonna get a hundred phone calls saying, hey, I found your keys. So <laughs> and there is no way to stop it. So there's a fun idea for you guys. But, uh, but anyway, so let me know what you guys think of this test. Uh, if you have any questions, hopefully I answered most of the questions. But, um, but yeah, I was actually really impressed with the Mini 3 Pro and how much weight that the Mini 3 Pro could carry for how much it weighs. And uh, so of course the, the Mavic 3 is gonna be the strongest one carrying two pounds, but, uh, but yeah. So uh, thanks for watching guys. Hopefully you got some value out of this. If you did, click on that thumbs up. Also subscribe for more videos for silly tests like this um, and lots of other videos. So, And finally, watch this video next because I know you're going to get some value out of it. I think you're going to really enjoy it. Have a great day, everyone. And as always, fly safe and fly smart.